What's up everybody, it's Chase here, and we are back to the Mario Odyssey Let's Play, but in this episode, we kind of took a turn for the worst. Um, what I'm meaning by that is, um, right now, uh, my recording software on um, that I'm using for my Switch is actually just a normal Elgato HD, not the HD60 or HD Pro or whatever, HD60 or whatever. Anyway, um, so... Uh, how am I supposed to say this? Well, to sum it up, basically my commentary did not line up with the actual um, gameplay so bad that I'm going to have to do this post commentary. That's hope that's alright with you guys. I'll be commentating this entire time. Um, like I'll try to be like normal, but I will probably just talk about other random stuff because I'm not really playing. I'm just sitting here talking and watching with you guys. Alright, so not to wait any longer. I mean, this is already like... 22 minute video so let's get into it right now all right so let's hit continue there we go anyway so right here um i was talking about how we just finished the metro kingdom and we have around 27 moons pop that on the odyssey and see if you saw it right there that little glitch you'll be sitting seeing those throughout like um throughout this episode because of the way my recording software is. I'm gonna have to, not my software, but the actual hardware to record it. It's just getting old. I need to, um, I need to update it, basically. So, I am actually working on it. I already have a updated version. I have a HD60. So, hopefully it'll be changed in the next one. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it, but see right now that glitch right there? Um, that was normal. Alright, so we had two options, Snow, uh, snow Kingdom Seaside, I pick Snow mostly because I'm not a big fan on swimming in like Mario games, so um, that's why I chose Seaside, I'm, it's just, if I can avoid swimming, I try to, because usually the mechanics aren't the best, I mean, this game isn't that bad, but I just try to avoid it in all cost. Alright, so we're just flying to the Seaside like normal. I just skipped this because who wants to see that? And yeah, we're talking about wall jumping here. If you haven't wall jumped so far in this, I I applaud you. I don't know how you did it, but you did. All right, um, here's the Snow Kingdom. So I'm sorry for these like glitches throughout the gameplay. I mean, these are gonna be happening um, just randomly throughout. So right now, starting off when you first get here. Um, it's going to be all dark and snowy like this. Um, that's just going to happen. Don't worry, it, it changes later. Alright, so right in those ice pillars, you can grab some coins if you really want some. But there's only one coin, so I don't really recommend doing that. Oh, there's another glitch. <laughs> Alright, so you go over here. Um, you just kind of cross that little walkway, and then you're um, confronted with a big pile of snow here. All you got to do is just use your hat. You can get rid of the snow. And it... It's just covering up a big hole to go down to, like, the city of this area, if you want to call it that. Alright, so we're going down, and right here. So, um, Chivaria Town, that's what it's called. And right off the bat, I know there's a power moon up here, and we're going to use that tip that we saw in the Odyssey. We're going to do some wall jumps, just wall jump off this box, and just push them away, and you're good. Really not too bad. Alright. And just bringing some boxes, just walking around. Right there, that's a. If you saw that on the wall, that's a little hint art you can get. Alright, and I believe. Yeah, I just go in through here. I buy the first. Uh, I buy the first Power Moon. Not the first Power Moon, but I buy a Power Moon. I almost bought that, but I didn't mean to. Alright, there we go. That's all it took. So, um, so I do have some new hardware. I, so I'm really hoping, I also, I am going to be updating the software too, don't think I'm dumb, but I am going to be updating the software as well to make sure it fits my computer. My computer should run perfectly fine. I have a process, I have the AMD uh, 8350 processor. My graphics card is perfectly fine. It's a Radeon 40. 480x um, sapphire it's not bad so my pc should be fine with the um software 
It just, I think my hardware is just getting old. All right, anyway, so we need to go down that hole where the Bowser face is, and we have to basically open it up by going through the, like, each four doors. And I go through this one. It really doesn't matter what order you go in. You can go in any order you want, but I chose to go in here. And this one, each room, I'm pretty sure, has two moons. But, again, um, not again, but, uh... I'm not 100% sure, because uh, there was one, there's one, uh, one room where I only got one, mostly because I didn't really look either. Um, but this one has two. So yeah, the first one all I gotta do is collect these shards, and obviously you get your moon. That's just how that goes. See, there we go. So a uh, little, I guess, quick channel update. Um, I'm gonna be trying to post. Uh, Wednesday like Tuesdays or Wednesdays because I have those days like off work So I want to try to post those days because I have time to record and there's a lot of there's a few videos I want to start making um, I think tonight. I'm gonna try to record um, a Little review. I want to I kind of want to go over the pros and cons of the new Fortnite that came well the new Fortnite that came out on switch um, because I played it and it's fun, but there are a lot of downsides, which I will get into depth in the video itself. Um, I've never really done a video like that, so um, I'm kind of skeptical on how it'll turn out. Whoa. Why did I do that? I don't know why I did that. That was really weird. Anyway. Well... Okay, so we just f um, we just finished the first room, and see a little uh, plate moved, and we just gotta get rid of all the plates. Oh yeah, right now. All right. And let's see. I think go to the okay. I d okay. So when I first played this, I thought um, you only could go through the doors with the bright lights, but that's not the case at all. You can go through any of them. I found that out. Um, but yeah, it's, yeah, okay, I think this is the one that I couldn't find the moon, mostly because I, I really didn't look, I'm pretty sure if you look, then you'll be able to find it, but, you know, here's some regional coins for you right there, first three I got, but I mean, there's more to be found, I mean, there was, there's more you could have gotten already, I'm not trying to 100% this, I'm just trying to do a quick, a uh, little let's play, a little walkthrough, trying to, get my channel out there, start it up. I know this uh, Let's Play has been long, long ridden. But, you know, I'm gonna... So, the main thing is that I'm pretty sure we're just gonna get this, um, get this Let's Play done, then start doing, uh, I kinda wanna do some reviews on games, like play them, give my thoughts on them, some feedback, maybe. And, yeah, I wanna do that. I really want to go over some other things. I kind of want to start um, giving little Pokemon Go updates because I am really into that right now. Because <laughs> I took a I took a really big break um, like last year on it, but now I'm getting back into it. Uh, if you really want to know, I am um, level 32. Uh, we just had the Larvitar event. If you guys were out there, that's you know how fun that was. Getting, I hope you guys got like your shiny Tyranitars and everything. I sure, I know I did, <laughs> cause actually, um, I called in to work for that. I called in sick to work, just so I could, um, go catch a bunch of Larvitar at a university. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, you did, you gotta do what you gotta do. But like, I called the day off. I called the day off, like um, a month prior, but they didn't let me have it off because Father's Day is the next day. And our store is pretty busy right before that, so like I understand, mm -hmm. but at the same time, like it kind of sucks because I wanna, I wanna be playing some Pokemon Go, so I just called in. Eh, I should do I recommend that? No, don't do that. But I did, so I can't really tell you no. All right, second room down. I'm pretty sure that was meant to be like the last room, but it's whatever. We got that one done. Second. And I really do like the Snow Kingdom. It's kind of fun. I really do like icy, um, 
icy places in Mario. See, I was really confused right there. But I really do like icy places in Mario. I don't know why. Um, I really, uh, I really start liking them um, during Mario Galaxy, uh, whenever it's a uh, hot and cold place, and you got to ice skate when you shook the Wiimote. I thought that was awesome. I, I kind of wish they would let me let us ice skate again, but yeah, it's whatever. Anyway, I don't know if you guys keep um, up to date with the E3 updates and whatnot, but. Um, Smash, let's go Pikachu, um, well let's go Eevee, um, and a few other games, I am very excited, I gotta admit, uh, I do, I do plan on doing a, another let's play for, uh, let's go Pikachu, mostly because I love, um, I love Pokemon, um, I plan on doing a let's play for that. Um, and I promise it will not take as long as this one is. I want to be uploading that at least two to three times a week. I would love to upload daily, but you know, I just, I don't have that kind of time throughout my day, mostly because I'm nearly, I'm nearly a full-time worker, and that's just how it is. I, I am trying to, I'm looking for a new job so I can get a better schedule, um, more like kind of, like how I like to explain it, school hours, like Monday through Friday, seven to four kind of thing. I'm trying to get that, but you know, that's that's a process. You know, it's you know I I can make all the excuses in my all I want, but really it's just me being lazy, not applying and stuff. And I, it's my last summer. I mean, I'm gonna call it my last summer, but I call it my last summer my last summer. But I just graduated. I'm just trying to relax a little bit, you know, have some fun, play some video games, start up a YouTube channel, just have some fun with it, you know. I like. Um, cause I, I watch, I watch a few channels, I really, um, I really like the channels that have, like, not a huge fan base, but a decent fan base, like, um, like a few hundred, few hundred to few thousand people that, like, are pretty active and talk to you. I think, to me, that's awesome. I love, like, interacting with people. I check my comments, um, my, like, one of my first comments I got on the, um, uh, what is it called? My little tutorial thing for uh, GBA for iOS. When I got a comment on that, I got so excited. Like, you can't even believe. It. Like, I can even believe it. Um, so I try to respond like instantly. Uh, so I just so, sometimes I am lazy. I don't check my YouTube channel like every day or every hour or anything. I check it here and there, mostly you know just to see any updates, see some. Um, if anything's changed, usually it doesn't. But I mean, that's that's a uh, that's a hard part with starting like a little new YouTube channel. I used to have a few others whenever I was younger, but I never kept up with them. I really wish I did to hope I'd kind of have a little group of people to talk to, you know, like to interact with, maybe do some live streams, have them interact with me. Just some fun things, you know. I for me, I find it really fascinating. I find it really cool talking to people. Just, you know, getting to know some people. That's one of my biggest things. I, I really like to get to know people. Um, even if it doesn't have to be on a personal level, just like a friendship level. I still love getting to know people. That's just how it is. Alright, let's talk about this gameplay. So this is our final room. And this part, I failed really hard on. I probably should have cut this out. Um, but I didn't. Um... Because I did like basically the hard editing already on this, but so I know there's a power moon up here where that little X is at the top of the um, arch, but I couldn't think of an easy way. Like I know the easy way to do it. You get a person like one of those big cloud dudes and you blow it, but I didn't want to do that. I was like, I'm stubborn. I'm gonna get this the way I want to. So I was like, jump. Oh, I can see I missed. And I like in the live commentary, I was like, I'm gonna keep all this in and it'll work. So I missed again. And people just came home, so if you hear that, I'm sorry, but that's just that's how it goes, you know. You live with people, that's just how it's gonna work. So I tried to go in an angle, didn't work. Um, you know, I, I'm stubborn. 
I, I was gonna get this no matter what. I changed the angle up because the way I was doing it before just made it really hard and really unnecessary. But this is where I get it. Perfect ground pound move. There you go. Pretty simple. Easy as that. Yeah, I'm sorry if you can hear some people in the background. I'll um. Uh, I don't really know what I'll do with it. I died right there. Oh well. I do want to get some like those soundproof like foam things to put on my wall so it doesn't sound so like echoey in here. Cause right now like my room you can bounce everything off. And that's just how it goes. I don't know why, it just it's just normal room. And I have hardwood floors, so that also just bounces off. Anyway. I need to stop saying it anyway so much. I don't know why I say it so much whenever I record. See, this time we don't have to get it. We're just gonna run. Um, avoid that dude. And I was like, this is not gonna happen again. And we just spray all these dudes down like a little gun. Like, brrrr. Last three. And there's a power moon. And that's how you do that. Hop out of him. And you're done. So far, I've seen like a few major cuts it's gotten kinda it's gotten better but eh, still I see some pretty big cuts in there that's oh my gosh please don't do anything wrong okay that's why like it was so annoying trying like I was editing I was um, cutting some little bits out that shouldn't have been in there um, like the beginning part like I I hit record and I wait like five minutes basically to start my actual commentary to kinda um, uh, you know, just kind of get a drink, sit down, and think about what I'm doing. Alright, now. We get on here, and it's like a race. And, um, I guess I'm kind of talking way ahead of the gameplay. But, so this is a race course. These big fat dudes are racers. And you're not allowed to be a racer because you're human. That's just how it is. These people are racist. Confirmed. Anyway. Um, so we gotta go find a racer and control his mind like, um, like freaks we are. So I checked through all this snow just to see if there's like a power moon or something. I go over here, there's some regional coins. Oh my gosh, my belly button is so sweaty. I probably shouldn't have said that out loud, but I did. Alright, um, oh, I don't know why, oh, I'm so dumb, and I'm not going to cut this out either, but this was supposed to be cut, I was, I had a phone call, so, uh, there's not much you can do about it, I just had a phone call, so we're just going to wait here for a few seconds, because I'm lazy and I don't want to edit anything, <laughs> alright, well, I'm pretty sure it only lasts like a minute. Oh my gosh. I just moved my stuff. Sorry, that was a loud spike right there. Alright, now we're done. So I completely passed the racer we're supposed to take over. And I thought he was up here. And I should have realized whenever I saw how high these regional coins were. Because I mean like... Look, see this... Oh, this is so cringy, I'm sorry. <laughs> See, I look down here, I'm like, wait, where's my dude? So I run back, and he's just ch chilling here in the corner. He's just scared to race. See, we talk to him, he's like, well, I don't want to race the others, but I'll take I wish he could take my place. We do. We take over his mind. Um... He has like seven spiky toes. Just hopping along. Get all these fat coins. And so I thought this race is not actually the easiest. And I thought I'd need like a few tries. And I, was a, I felt like I was going to have to cut out so much crap. But I didn't. I didn't have to. Um, um, right here. Um, you can do a little warm up round. I suggest you do. I didn't do it. Because I felt pretty confident. So, right here, the Bound Bowl Grand Prix. So the trick to this is, 
just hitting the angles and pressing A or I think B. That's how you like bound or bounce. Oh uh, yeah, B. Um, you hit like the angles like um, right here the side of the wall. Press B right on that, and if you have that like coloring around you, that's what happens whenever you get it right. And I suggest just keep on bounding um, whenever you're just bouncing because of, like the bigger the height the better the bounce is going to be when you hit the side walls or just like slopes and right here I was kind of nervous like it's so easy to get behind but right there I bounce it perfectly and bounce over that like you can do really good shortcuts and then like whenever you're like this you're you're pretty much good you're pretty much set you want to just you just want to take as many shortcuts as you can bounce off these walls as best you can and just hit these angles and if you get stuck in here just spam B for me I did not care I was like keep going just spam B and then you should be alright and like that we're done pretty easy race not that bad um 19, 19 seconds my best lap right there uh, I really don't know the best, the fastest lap you can possibly have, but there we go. We get a multi moon for it, though. All right, let's see. So we get out of that. We take our crown. All these fat dudes are crying, and we're human, and we beat them at their own sport. That's right. Dun -dun -dun -dun. There we go. So I was debating on if I should explore the land a little bit or not. I decided not to because this video is already 23 minutes and I really don't like making these 20 minute videos because I feel like they're just so long. Um, so I look around, like I let you see the view a little bit. I'm making the decision to let, you know, the players explore this on their own. You know, I'm, I've played it, I've gotten every single moon in this land so a oh, dog just went up to my door and did something to it anyway so I was showing the moons there's only 37 here it's really not too bad it's a small small little kingdom nothing too crazy um, I just run around here for a little bit anyway um so really next time on the Mario Odyssey let's play I, all this should be figured out I know like it's frustrating dealing with like um uh, just my issues on this side, like, you know, you guys are just try and watch, like, I mean, and this, this kind of stuff just happens, but I should have it fixed, um, hopefully, we'll see, I'm gonna hopefully get a video up here pretty soon, probably maybe this week or next week, uh, just depending on when I upload this, alright, anyway, next time, on Super Mario Let's Play, I'll see you guys then.